Hey everybody, with the launch of the FFM segments feature, I wanted to show everyone how to sh create a new segment in the app. Um, so you'll open up the OneWheel app, you'll go over to this Maps tab, you'll go to Your Rides um, by selecting Rides and then hitting this Map button up in the top right hand corner. You can see that there are Rides, Segments, and Charge Points here. That's the ride that I did today. Um, we're going to create a segment. Um, I've already created one, but I learned a few things from it. So this is the short and quick version. So um, tap that plus symbol down in the bottom right hand corner here. You'll select the ride that you want to create a segment from. So I'll go to this FFM Tour of Walnut. Um, I'll select it. I'm going to make this public. I'm going to do Enter Log Loop. Um, fast flowy trail all right so this is your line so it's really simple you just crop the um, line your ride wherever you want it to start and end so I think that's where um, inner log loop is over here and so this is going to be huge. So you see these lines, these like geometric lines, that's your tracking. So one of the things that I learned uh, is that you can't have your start and your finish, which are these red boxes intersecting where the segment starts. So some of these um, are actually going to be difficult because of how close they are. We'll have to extend them. So. Another pro tip is that you can fine tune it by the second here uh, versus doing that um, dragging feature which is a little more sensitive. So you can see here, this is all the paved path actually. So inner log loop is going to start like right here where we get off the paved path. You can see it doesn't intersect with anything. Now the ending is intersecting with the path. This is a big conflict point. Um, so I've got to change the ending now to be like over here by outer log loop. I th don't think that's going to work either. Yeah, see, I keep getting this error, which is going to be challenging to create new segments here. So so the red boxes are actually showing you that this is conflicting start and end points. Um, but you can see that, like, nowhere, both of them start and end right here. Um, and there's no way that they're not going to conflict without pulling them, like, way over here or something and even then they're still conflicting with the rest of the path so it's challenging